Yeah. When I walk in the club, I make the haters mad off. Just as I can shake and rap, even fast off. Why you acting all black? Put it in the store when you hear the pop. So, I just left Michael's to start a new commission. Yeah, uh, so yeah, I, I'm i excited. I This is my second commission work. Um, so if you're interested, email me at unapologeticallyshar because I do plan on spending more time on painting. And if you want a customized painting, either I can paint from my own inspiration and I can send it to you and we can discuss the details of what you kind of envision. Or you can tell me exactly what you want and I'll repaint it for you. But in order to get the detailing of the pricing and how long it will take and shipping, shipping and handling, you have to email me at unapologetically shy. So. Good morning. It is, of course, another beautiful day to get your mind right. So today I'm on my way, of course, like always, to the gym. It's my morning routine. Uh, eventually, I do want to set up what my routine is like every day. But realistically, every day my routine changes. I pretty much do the same thing every day. But it varies so yeah last night all i did was just prep for my next painting i just research more knowledge about acrylics painting and also just looked at other artists who were basically living as an artist so that's what i did last night and i edited a video so if you have not seen last week's video it's already up and if you haven't watched any of my other videos you should um and just leave a comment subscribe like all the above <laughs> seven I think I've been up since like 4 45 my goal had to actually be, get, to get up which I was able to do um I started I know I started a new devotional today and it is talking about how to keep joy so that's my goal um I started painting this picture it means a little bit more to me. My dad actually is paying me to paint his mother, which is someone who meant the world to me. Like, I don't even think it's an understatement. And when I showed like my brothers, I have two brothers, one is four years older than me one is when a year and eight months no a year and ten months younger than me and I showed them the picture of our grandma who passed away and they all got like excited so this one means a little bit more even when I'm painting her it's like that smile and like it's like a sense of she's proud of me is what I feel like yesterday when I was finishing up the second layer I was like oh, I think she will love it anyways good morning headed to the gym yet again <laughs> Thank you. 
good morning i just want to end the vlog now because i want to spend the rest of my sunday just with my family and just in good spirits i need a pick me up right now um and it's no real reason like i am actually really in a really really good place like if i think back over this week i have been to michael's in and out of michael's this week and not on my expense like on the expense of someone else and i'm gonna just and i don't say that to be like bragging or to say like um you know boastful but to say in a sense that prayer works and that it really really works because last week i was really in the um i don't know if you're familiar with the bible <clears throat> and if you're not you know or if you're familiar with the story if you're not, um, I'll just break it down to you really quickly. And to me, the story, it was where I was last last week. Jesus was taken to the highest, right? Um, when he went on his fast, when it was after he completed his 40 days of fasting, he was, he had went to just the highest place. And um, the enemy, he came and he presented all of what, jesus could have if he banked on on what the world says makes you happy <clears throat> and so he was presented with everything that any man's heart would want if it isn't in his purest place if it's in a place that's just i'm, I'm trying to get to where i need to go then yeah but because jesus heart was pure and was of nothing but love he realized that God can do that, whatever, and then some, and multiply it. And so last week I was in that position, and um, because I'm, I've been wise with my money, I've, I've stored, and I've been storing, as, as everyone should do. Everyone should store. And I've learned that from a very young age that it's important to store what you have. Even if you have a dollar, you save 50 cents. <laughs> Like, um, not not 25, not 10, not 5, not, no, you save 50, even if it's your dollar. If you have $2, you put that $1 away. And so that's how I have become with my, with my saving. And so my, my normal spending amount has depreciated to nothing. <laughs> and I got bills. Like, I got ashy. I got bills. I got bills, bills. And I have always just been, since, I mean, even before college, um, but after college, I really got that mindset that I didn't want to have to ask anybody because if I was to borrow, you're going to get paid back. I pay back everybody. I don't like owing. Um, and so since, you know, I decided to be this creative liver, I was tempted with, do you touch your storage? You know? You got enough to touch it, but you touch it, and you got to pay this bill. You you always pay people, so do you? You know what I'm saying? Do you pay this bill or do you not pay this bill? And I was like, nope. When I was in the park, <laughs> I went back to the park and I prayed hard and long, and I prayed. The camera dropped. That's how I know the story's supposed to be told. <laughs> Let me get it right. Let me get it right. Now, so I had prayed a very powerful prayer. And I prayed from the deepest of my hearts. I prayed from something that it was just a dance between me and my creator. And it felt like that. And I asked for God to continue to lead me in every step that I take. In every move that I make. In every decision I decide. In every thought that I process keep my eye on him like or on on the creator keep my eye on, on on what is good keep my eye on what is true keep my eye on what is presented to me keep my eye on on who i've been becoming and and, and my true self and my true one and that that there is a, a greater spirit that lives within me that is just waiting to go all right let's do this you want to let's go all right money let's go but in that moment i didn't feel it but it's like i, I pray for god to be my leader 
as we dance this dance, as we tango, as I learned this dance, as a baby in this dance, as a as a newborn, as as someone who has never done this before, teach me your ways, teach me your steps so I can learn it. And ever since then, I've just been dancing with God and I've just been going to Michael's <laughs> like every day. It's, it's so wild. And it's just day four. <laughs> it's just day four. It's just day four. And for every day, like I'm like excited for today because the last three days, it's been like, okay, yeah, can you paint me this? Boom, deposit. Hey, can you? Boom. And it's just been working. Oh, come on. You know, I get emotional and I cut the camera off. So I'm not going to let this keep going too much longer. <clears throat> and just knowing that, I, you know, I was able to just dance, to dance with, dance with like someone greater. It's just amazing. Like, you know, my bills still got to get paid, but all of my bills are paid. Dog. Like, all of my bills are paid. <laughs> So, um, if you haven't learned anything from my videos, if you have been supporting my videos, first of all, shout out to all my, my loved ones who tell me, be like, I watch all three of your videos. Y'all mean the world. Y'all are my love books. That hits me so much. And I'm emotional right now because if you have been watching me and you have been supporting, you would see the growth too. <laughs> and then like, it's like, I know the full story of where I'm sitting at today on 10 11 2020 so it's just like it's good the quality quality over quantity man quality over quantity work your passion work your passion work your passion quality over quantity and like if anything keep going keep going keep going I wish I could, that's one thing I would have told myself younger absolutely don't stop that grind like don't let don't let what is presented to you get in your way of, of being your truest self like tap into that I'm about to go work out um I love y'all <laughs> see y'all in the next vlog